Yes, I think we spoke to you on the 25th of May. And last time, you told Bloomberg TV that you think the new Deutsche Bank chief executive has the right strategy. Do you still think that is true? Yes. I still think that uh, Christian Seving is the right man at the right position and has the right strategy. Um, you shouldn't forget that uh, these problems are um, problems of the past, and he has to solve these problems. Um, Christian Seving was uh, absolutely right when he informed the shareholders at last week's uh, general meeting that Deutsche Bank is still uh, uh, having uh, serious problems, uh, especially in the U.S. investment uh, business. And um, as we see right now, that was true what he was saying. And uh, it is absolutely right that uh, especially um, Christian Seving and his uh, uh, colleagues are concentrating on the problems in the United States. But I'm looking at the share price of Deutsche Bank, and it cannot be easy for a lot of your members that have exposure to Deutsche Bank looking at this chart. Does Mr. Saving need to accelerate cuts? What kind of message does he now need to give to regulators and the markets to slop the slide in share price? It's at €9.45. Um, the, the most important thing what Saving and his colleagues are needing right now is time, and uh, shareholders have to give this time. Um, they, they can't... Uh, uh, they can't uh, uh, expect any any wonders uh, overnight, for for example. Christian Seving is working on, on uh, several um, issues and several problems of the bank uh, at the same time. He is trying to cut, cut the costs of the bank. Uh, he is uh, trying to uh, reorganize the U.S. investment uh, banking business of Deutsche Bank. Uh, he has merged uh, Postbank and uh, Deutsche Bank uh, uh, retail uh, customers' uh, uh, area. So uh, he is working on several problems at the same time. And uh, um, I, I, I would like to point out another thing. The, the actual U.S. problems uh, Deutsche Bank has aren't so uh, uh, significant as they are so important as they seem on the on the first view. Um, you have to bear in mind that um, the assets of the three entities concerned uh, of uh, this uh, U.S. Uh, authorities' uh, action right now are below 10 percent of the overall balance sheet of Deutsche Bank Group. So uh, it, it doesn't concern a real, um, uh, let's say, uh, a, a real problem uh, or a real uh, big area of, of, of the bank. And, and Klaus, I, I understand that you're saying, look, the new chief executive needs time. These are legacy problems. But why own Deutsche Bank and not something else in Germany? Why own Deutsche Bank and not BNP Paribas? Pardon me, I didn't, I, I didn't get that. The, the, the line was bad. Yeah, so the question is, why would you own this bank, Deutsche Bank, when shares keep on falling and not buy another bank as a shareholder? Yeah, th th that's a good question. Um, I think if you are already invested in Deutsche Bank, uh, you, you, you shouldn't sell the, the shares right now. Um, I'm uh, convinced that uh, share price uh, won't go down any further or uh, uh, won't fall uh, down under, let's say, eight euros per share. So uh, it doesn't make sense to, to sell shares right now. Um, I think it, it makes more sense to buy the shares right now because the reorganization of Deutsche Bank is uh, uh, in process. And uh, if you trust in Christian Seving and his, and his new team uh, and you give him this time, uh, you can really buy Deutsche Bank shares. Deutsche Bank is uh, still the largest uh, bank of Germany, is still one of the largest banks uh, of Europe, and is very important for German economics and for the German industry. <clears throat> and therefore, uh, I'm convinced that Deutsche Bank uh, will, uh, will get better, let's say, um, uh, and, and its share price will increase, uh, let's say, in the next 6 to 12 months. Um, Klaus, a final question. Do you think Commerzbank and Deutsche Bank should merge? Hmm. The, the problem is if you, uh, if you merge two banks which have uh, both problems, uh, then you don't solve any problems, but you double, uh, it may be that you double problems. So uh, this is a very difficult question you are asking. Um, I think a full, merge, a full merger is not, is, uh, doesn't make any, any, uh, a, a real sense and doesn't create any value. Um, it may be that a cooperation in several business areas uh, would make sense, but uh, I'm very skeptical uh, concerning a full merger.